all three is here in uh, Palm Sub Resort in City of Inter, California, catching up with world title contender Asad Crazy A. Hovanesian. The ways are done, guys. Mutual respect. How, tell us how the weigh-ins went down. Asuma, Kashervel Kart and Parcella, the Hargan Kunek, he had interest cards in this moment. Won't say it's a moment to answer. Shot normal answer. Um, you know, the, the moment is, is pretty normal, nothing special at that time, uh, ready for a fight, uh, everyone's respectful, so nothing too crazy is happening. A little dehydrated, a little, little hungry? I can tell you no, no, <laughs> I, weight cut was great, hungry okay. sure, dehydrated not, uh, fully filled in, about to go have some lunch, perfect. Okay. Um, the, the chap, Leo Snedi, he's been known for having wars, bottles, and, and uh, he's had weight problems in the past. He seems to be like in the perfect shape, best, probably best shape of his life. A great, probably, war going down tomorrow. How does Asad Hovanesian feel about facing the best of Luis Neri? Ereguma would pass to Luis Neri Kasheri program. But this is the Ereguma would in Kerlav, Lav, Parapella, Kasher Tochnia, and Kapatrasta. Two inches carton would do test Neluis, Amina Lav, Pijaka, Luis Neri, Amina Lav, Johnny. That's exactly how we prepared him to come. Did not expect anything less than him to come 100% ready. Fighting in the Los Angeles area, big Armenian community. You expect a big Armenian uh, fan base tomorrow yes. showing up at the arena? Yes. Uh, Los Angeles, Very thankful for everybody that's coming to support him or watching him. He's going to put on a show for them, especially. Second fight, you get to have Julian Shu as your head trainer. Yeah, bro, boy, now what he might Julian head this. Extremely happy to be with Julian now. Um, he's fighting far more intelligently now than he has in the past. Asad, you have power, Luis Neri has power. Do you expect this fight to go all 12 rounds? <laughs> We'll see. We have to wait and see. <laughs> it's it's hard to say, you know, when you're and I'll speak for him on this one. When you're fighting somebody at that caliber, to make predictions is very very silly. But regardless, if it's a few rounds or twelve rounds, it's gonna be a war from one to twelve for sure. One more question. Everything goes right tomorrow. As that, do you expect to fight for the WBC belt, being uh, Stephen Fulton, or you know? If they, if we know a way to face the uh, Fulton, you get to face the winner of those two. Dima do gides for do Tanelu es es boya, do koti hamar es kapnelu, kam Fulton i kam in a way ahead. Do matatu mes dura mas in temian es boya. Yeah, it doesn't matter who is Fulton is in. I think it's 50-50 fight. 50-50 doesn't matter who we fight. Thank you very much. There's nothing else to be said. Now, tomorrow. Thank you very much, guys.